wiki.easyvid.com. Search EasyVid Wiki before you decide. EasyVid presents the 10 best art books. Let's get started with the list. Starting off our list at number 10, the big book of art is perfect for the whole family as it takes a look at all types of art from the caveman era all the way to the modern day, making it appeal to all ages. It looks at the effect of technology on art, and over 1200 works of art are represented. However, it only briefly touches on each period. At number 9, the Modern Art Cookbook is a relatively small book that examines how artists have been inspired by the food of their time to see how it shaped their artistic style. It's not quite a cookbook or an art history book. It shows food from a variety of regions and includes numerous artists' recipes. Coming in at number 8 on our list, Art That Changed the World tells the story of dramatic periods in art history that sparked change and the events that helped shape their evolution. This book focuses on culture's significance in art and highlights many influential paintings. It shows a visual timeline. To see all this stuff, go to wiki.easyvid.com and search for art books or click beneath this video. At number 7, Visual History of Typefaces is a unique book that looks at typography and font styles as art and traces the evolution of the printed letter with numerous depictions. It includes lithographic examples and provides a scholarly review of typefaces. This is a conversation-starting coffee table book. Moving up our list to number 6. Egon Schiele, The Beginning, is the first book to focus on his early life and artwork, starting from childhood until his resignation from the Vienna Art Academy in 1909. It shows Schiele developing his style and includes essays by art historians. It has a number of large-scale images. Halfway up our list at number 5. The Men of Flamenco was photographed in Andalusian Spain and presents a universe inhabited by gypsies, musicians and male flamenco dancers, many in mid-dance movements. It has 200 pages, all of which contain photos, in high contrast black and white. It combines fashion and documentary photos. At number 4, 100 Illustrators examines the work of successful and important illustrators from around the world, including artists such as Istvan Banyai and Anita Kunz. It's a snapshot of contemporary illustration and includes a self-portrait by each illustrator. It also has lists of selected exhibitions. Nearing the top of our list at number 3, Separate Cinema is a visual celebration of the first 100 years of black poster art, including a look at the black film industry from the earliest days of Hollywood. This is a rare glimpse into a forgotten history that has some very insightful text and is bursting with colorful reproductions. To see all this stuff, go to wiki.easyvid.com and search for art books or click beneath this video. Number 2. My Photo Album gives you a glimpse into the life of British artist Tracy Emin using a collection of photos from her personal collection, including her handwritten notes. It's made in a photo album style and documents a unique period in art history. It includes over 250 never-before-published images. And coming in at number 1 on our list. The Art of Pinup is an interesting read for casual fans as well as hardcore pinup collectors. It profiles the top 10 artists in depth and documents their creative process. It features thumbnail bios of more than 85 artists, behind the scenes source photographs, and high quality pinup images. To see all this stuff, go to wiki.easyvid.com and search for art books or click beneath this video.